Hi everybody, uh, my name is uh, Dr. Farooq Ibrahim. Uh, I will just start by saying first, uh, praising the Lord, uh, and we start in His name, uh, the most merciful and the most beneficent. Uh, my first uh, interaction and uh, information about the uh, Perinatal Mental Health Project uh, began several years ago when I uh, was invited to a small meeting uh, in Toronto uh, by the University of Cape Town. Uh, where, Dr., where Professor Honekman gave a uh, very um, passionate talk about uh, the needs at uh, this particular uh, department of uh, UCT. Uh, that particular day, I uh, obviously went home and as a family, as most families do, uh, we were at the supper table and I brought up this uh, meeting with Dr. Honekman. Uh, in Canada, all children uh, at going to school uh, need at least 40 hours of volunteering in order to uh, uh, complete or to graduate from high school. Um, but volunteering and um, charity work, uh, in specifically from my experience in Canada, uh, is a privilege and people are very anxious and forthcoming to do it. Uh, so there's nothing special that we as a family were doing. We, everybody does it here. Uh, and it was at this time that uh, my family and especially my children felt uh, how could they contribute towards this uh, project, uh, especially uh, because our connection uh, to South Africa was so passionate and so strong. Um, henceforth, uh, we, uh, we as a family uh, and especially my children uh, felt that they could help in contributing and they channeled some of their charity funds that they're able to collect uh, towards this project. And I'm hopeful that uh, it has made a difference uh, in other people's lives. Uh, but I can tell you that it definitely made a difference in our lives. Uh, but, uh, even though we know that the contribution was small and, and, and not as great as we wish we could do. And hopefully we can do more in the future. I'm hopeful that uh, we can continue to be given the privilege to be part of this project that uh, so many people contribute to uh, and are able to help with. I'll just mention uh, one last thing. Uh, Professor Honekman uh, was very kind on my last, uh, most recent visit to Cape Town, where she gave me a tour of uh, Hanover Park uh, and, uh, and, and the needs that are required there. I'm hopeful that, uh, that that project will be very successful and I'm hopeful that uh, we can take part in, uh, in helping in the success and be part of the success. Uh, so I want to thank everybody for, for, for first of all, uh, for having UCT, uh, for keeping the standards of uh, care and uh, uh, reaching out to communities uh, in Cape Town but all over the world and uh, being a role model and, um, and a template that, and, that other countries and other people can uh, follow. So I want to thank everybody. Uh, and uh, it is with this humble request that I say thank you very much.